Hey guys, that's Sparrow here, and welcome back for more Sparrow Co. And what I've done, what, as you can see, I have done some improvements. I've pretty much just done a wee pathway. The factory is about seventy percent complete. Uh, still, I might add another floor to it. I'm not entirely sure at this moment in time. But the forms, I've, I've sorted out the forms where I couldn't get it working the last time. I was just being an idiot, but they're working now. They're fully automated, so I don't have to care about them no more. Um, I'll go into the fo I'll go into the factory here, sorry, and show you what I've done in here. I've pretty much just got the crusher in here. I built a wee bookshelf for all our Tinker's Construct books and stuff to go on there, so they're out of our inventory. This here chest it just contains all this random stuff that I don't have a clue of how to make or what to use it for. As you go upstairs, there's nothing here yet, but this here is going to be the floor where the main production of cider is going to be. I think. I think at this moment. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut a hole in this wall and I'll show you what I'm going to do here with this with the hole in the wall is that the, it's going to be up lead up to here and I've leveled this area all out up here this is where I'm going to be planting my orchard apple orchards and I'm going to get a harvester and we'll have to build a harvester it's going to chop the trees down it is also going to feed the apples and the saplings into a system a planting system so they're replanted uh, the apples are going to go along a conveyor belt which is going to go into the factory hopefully this is, this is what the plan hopes to be where it's going to go straight into the, the fermenting uh, block which will help us um, make produce cider now that is what it's supposed to be whether it goes that way is a completely different story so hopefully over the next few episodes we'll be able to get that sort of started um, so what I'm going to do maybe this episode is maybe make the scaffolding and see where I actually want this to come out with. So I might actually uh, go into the factory. Uh, let's see. Uh, do I want it to come out? Do it, is it this block I want it to go in? Come out here? I think it will. I think I'll do it this side. Like here, and then build it across from here. So I'm gonna need some scaffolding. So let's see, we'll get some scaffolding on the go. Uh, we'll use this wood. Now that I try and find where the hell my chisel is, it's becoming night time. So we'll sleep as well, and we'll get stuck into this first thing. So let's close these doors. Go to sleep. Right, so let's see. Chisel chisel, there we go. So we'll stick this in and scaffolding, I think it's this, yep. There we go, we've got 64, that should do us for the meantime. Uh, any mobs about, because I don't want to get blown up by a creeper. Right, so let's see. Obviously, I'm gonna make it. Oh God, I'm gonna make it look a bit better. So at the moment, it's gonna be like a straight line across. So let's see. It's here. The hell was that? Was that an Enderman? Anyway. Oh God damn it! I thought I was holding shit. Oh. I thought I was holding shift. Actually, I'll just leave that there because it might actually work. Right. Shift is in place. Hopefully it doesn't... There we go. That is perfect. That's where it's going to come in. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to the conveyor belt is going to go here. Hmm. Conveyor belt and harvester is going to go here. So what I'm going to do is um, was that is that one? I'll do a two. I'll do here. Two. And then that last one's going to go here right across that window. 
<laughs> there we go, and I'll put some carpenter's triangles actually on it to make it look a bit more realistic. So let's see, we'll see do we have any? We should have some carpenter, carpenter's triangles about the place. So let's see. Yeah, we do. Happy days. So we'll get some carpenter's triangles and we'll make it look as if it's a bit more aesthetically pleasing. Uh, let's see, so... No. Don't know why that... What the hell? Why is that being a douchebag? Why is that being... Right. Why is it not... Okay, this is being a pain in the ass. Why is it being a pain in the backside? Okay. So this is obviously being, I don't know what... Why is it... Are these carpenters trying wedge slopes? Then why are they... Right, there's a, a spiky bit in it. I don't know what that is. Do I need to get the carpenter's... I don't know what saying. I might need to get the carpenter's chisel. Because obviously something... Have I just wasted... No, I haven't. What's oh, a... Hold on a second. I think I might have... be able to sort out now. There we go. I was using the wrong... Oh, crap. No. There we go. We've got it now. Just took me 20 minutes nearly to flip and sort that out. All this here to make it look as if it looks a bit decent. There we go, got some scaffolding on the, we've got some scaffolding done. So, I've got to take these out of the way, haven't I? Move out of the way. There we go. So we've got some scaffolding, I'll need to do this here side as well. Where is it? There we go. There. So there's the scaffolding done. So now we need what we need to go and do is um I'm gonna have to like get away up here instead of having to go the long way around. Um so that's what where the conveyor belt is actually gonna go on to. Um, I might need to sort the harvester out and how it's going to be, how it's going to work actually to be honest with you. Um, hmm. Because it's going to come across here, in here, get sorted. This room will probably be full of conveyor belts actually to be honest with you. So this could be, this might just be, have to be the conveyor belt room. I might end up having to extend it out. Ow extend it out a bit across into this here building to make it a bit bigger. Um but we'll soon we'll we'll work it out as it comes along so we'll but I say this is where the main this is the main conveyor belt and say this is gonna be the main area where all our orchards are gonna go. So it's gonna be pretty good. I'm gonna have to probably get rid of all the trees around the surrounding area because I don't want the harvester having to chop them down. Um as for par I'll have to come, we'll have to sort something out for power. 
Um, the second main, th the second thing that was on the agenda is, yes, these farms are automated, and I'm not really going to be dealing much with them. But there is the problem of sludge, and as you can see, the sludge. Well, this one's not too bad, but the one over here, because it's doing so much. Oh, the sludge is increasing, so we're going to need to put somewhere, like somewhere, to put the sludge. And what I was thinking of doing is doing a few sludge boilers at the back there, just right at the back, so that don't um, it doesn't look that bad. So that's another thing that's on the cards. So yeah, as you can see, we're we're making some progress. So we are, we've got that up, and we just need to sort of like sort out how it's going to be um, automated and how what way it's going to work out. But we'll we'll get there in the end. We've got the forms for some of our. Um, essences and all that we're going to probably need like redstone and stuff but I'm going to get rid of some of these and replace them with better like gold essence and stuff when we get a chance um, so yeah pretty much that's what we're going to do what we're going to do actually again in this here episode before we call it quits is I'm going to make a statue it's one thing that I have wanted to do and I'm going to make a statue out of do I have enough no stone can you make it out of cobblestone I'm assuming it is out of cobblestone so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make cut the cobble cut the cobblestone. I'm gonna see. I did actually make a co um a chisel, I think, or is it a hammer? That's a carpenter's hammer. Yep, hammer for statues. So I'm gonna sort of make this. And where am I gonna put the statue? Maybe outside the factory. Maybe here. Put it. And let's see. There we go. Um, I'll put in my. Let's see what's this arm. Makes me look like a Nazi. There we go. Uh, sculpt it. Voila. There we go. Statue of me, and what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to put it on like a wee. Um, I don't know actually what to put it on. I might just put it on. Do you know what actually? I'm going to get rid of it because I've got an idea. I've got an idea. How many of these? 60. Good, because this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put the statue here. So I am, so I'm going to. Gonna be a big ass statue. One, two, three. Let's see, five. Five. So the center one's gonna be this here, one here. And it's gonna be raining, or it's gonna be raining, it's night time, so <laughs> I'll sleep. I also have the buckets of water that I need as well. I'm going to put some water in the statue. See, if I put a block there, it's just gonna mess up the water, isn't it? It is. Well, first things first.
Do you know what actually you won't go do? There we go. There we go. You've got a, a fountain with my sculpture on top of it. I just need to make it a little more prettier by putting stars probably around it, which I'll do now. Have I got a crafting bench in here? I do. Um. I can hear a bloody Enderman about somewhere. Go away. There he's there. He's got a hat on his head. God damn grass. I hate grass. I hate grass. Uh, there we go. Uh, just get more of these. Because I'm clearly going to need them. Uh, yeah, 12. That should be more than enough, I think. I think. There we go. I'll just need to put some torches or something on it. But there we go. There's like a, a nice big statue or fountain with my statue on top of it as if it's floating. <laughs> but anyway, it looks pretty cool. But anyway, I'm going to leave it there, guys. This is going to be the end of this episode. So please leave a like, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And we'll see you next time.